You know, in the future, and Uncle Frank was telling me about this, we're all going to have the news. We won't read papers or go on the Internet. The news will be beamed directly into our brains. But uh, that technology is months away, right, Uncle Frank? No, but I don't like that. You don't like that? Why not? I like reading in person. Yeah, well, you won't be around when it happens, oh. but... <laughs> so don't worry about it, but the rest of us will. So what we've done is we've hired an action news reporter to fill that gap between now and then. He's a battle-tested Pulitzer Prize winner. His name is Pablo Suzuki, and he files this report. Go for Pablo. There's breaking news. I'm on it. came from and we are live we are getting reactions to the ongoing schism between former Seinfeld actor Michael Richards and the African-American community as you know uh, yesterday mr. Richards appeared on Jesse Jackson's radio program boogie down with Jesse with uh, founder of the Black Panthers Joan Van Ark uh, Mr. Richards stated that Jews should not be allowed to own items such as the PlayStation 3 because they, quote, have enough already, unquote. Do you think that all Jews look alike? Uh, no more so than all white people, all black, or all Asian, or, or any other race. But you have to admit that Asians really do look alike. Uh, no, because I can tell the difference between Chinese, Korean, and Japanese. They're all different. Have you ever heard uh, this piece of poetry? Chinese, Japanese, dirty knees. Look at these. <laughs> Tragic news out of the Chatsworth, California area. Oh boy. The porn capital of the world. Manager of the Los Angeles Dodgers, former manager of the Los Angeles Dodgers, yes. Tommy Lasorda, yes. has passed on. No, he has. Not. He has. For his uh, 76th birthday, um, he took a balloon up. Apparently, there was some uh, uh, faulty uh, wicker in the basket, and uh, Mr. Lasorda fell right through and plummeted to his demise. Your reaction? I can't believe it. It's true. This is unbelievable. It's very sad, isn't it? Well, it sure would be. Yeah. Tommy Lasorda. Oh, my God. I'm sorry to hear that. Really? No, I'm just busting your balls. I'm just busting your balls, Henrietta. Oh, you're a good sport. You're a good sport. Get over here. And we're live. We're getting reactions to the ongoing strife in the Middle East. Uh, as you know, Hamas leader Sheikh Omar Ben Vereen has called for the immediate removal of all Israeli troops from the Gaza Strip or as he claims there will be global ramifications. Your reaction? Uh, I, I really feel that uh, we need to be where we are. I, I think we need to hang in there and uh, I think it's important. Hold on one second. It's time again for today's answer to the Pablo Pop Quiz. The question, what was the least popular stocking stuffer from the year 2003? Penny Shields. Pull this. And we're live. We're getting news out of the Las Vegas metropolitan area, where at this hour, citizens are stunned at the news that uh, Aaron Carter, brother of Nick Carter, has been um, engaged in a high-speed chase after tasing singing legend Wayne Newton in the face. Apparently, they were at a party at the new club, Club Snort, in the Aladdin Hotel. Should celebrities be allowed to tase other celebrities? No, Tell me why. All. I mean, they're comrades. You know, it, there's a camaraderie there between actors and actresses. And I mean, they're, I mean, that, that shouldn't happen. I mean, it's, it, that's a sad thing. I'm really, I can't believe it. Something like that could happen. Again, to review, Aaron Carter has tasered Wayne Newton in the face at Club Snort in the Aladdin Hotel. I have to pee like a racehorse. Hold this. Am I supposed to be speaking? I, I, you know, this is just something I, I just can't believe is happening. Um, I just heard the news and 
I'm just a pole that. Uh, this just in, rapper Teabag is dead. Rapper Teabag is dead. <laughs> well, there it is. Another busy and controversial holiday season is upon us. Live from the farmer's market, I'm Pablo Suzuki. Have a Merry Chris Kwanzaa this America. <laughs> Thank you, Pablo. We will be right back with Kay Diggs.